Sure. In this part of the tutorial series on string methods in Python, we will cover some additional string methods that can be very useful for manipulating and analyzing text. Specifically, we'll look at the following methods. 1. str partition. 2. str partition. 3. str split lines. 4. stress fill. 1. str partition. The partition method splits a string into three parts based on a specified separator. It returns a tuple containing the part before the separator, the separator itself, and the part after the separator. If the separator is not found, it returns the original string and two empty strings. Syntax Python str partition separator example Python text hello, how are you? If the separator is not found Python result text partition world print result output hello, how are you? Syntax Python str partition separator example Python text one, two, three, two result text partition, print result output one, two, three, two if the separator is not found Python result text partition four print result output one, two, three, two, three, strass split lines the split lines method splits a string into a list of lines. It recognizes different new line characters and RAN RAND can optionally remove the new line characters from the resulting list. Syntax Python str split lines keepins false keepins if set to true, the new line characters will be included in the resulting list. Example Python text hello world how are you? Keeping the new line characters lines within text split lines keepins true print lines within output hello world and how we are you. If the original string is longer than the specified width, it returns the original string. Syntax Python string spill width example Python number 42 padded number number spill 5 print padded number output 42 negative number 42 padded negative negative number spill 5 print padded negative output 42 summary. In this part of the tutorial, we learned about several useful string methods in Python partition or partition, split lines, and spill. These methods can help you manipulate and analyze strings effectively in your programs. Feel free to reach out if you have any questions or need further examples.